Love shopping at Family Dollar? Well, about 400 stores are set to close. News Channel 8's Rod Carter is live at a Family Dollar store in Tampa with details about what's changing. Hey, Rod. Hey, good evening, Jen. The list of which Family Dollar stores will close has not been released yet, but I can tell you, the one here off Columbus Avenue has only been open for about a year, and the manager says he doesn't have it. He has doesn't have any idea if this store is slated to be one that's going to be closed. Customers I talked to say they certainly hope it does not get cut. Family Dollar is a staple for many people across the Bay Area. They offer food and goods at a discounted rate and are relatively convenient. This is by my job, so that's the only reason I'm here now. But soon your neighborhood Family Dollar could close up shop. As the company announced today, they will shutter 390 stores nationwide. Which ones, we still don't know. Some shoppers think some stores need to close. I went to some, i never step into again. Yeah. And she'll tell you that. Yeah. It's crowded, it's just crowded. Crazy. It's nasty food and everything on the floors on the aisles. And but the news isn't all bad. Company officials told me today they plan to renovate 1,000 stores, rebanner 200 locations, changing those from family dollar stores to Dollar Tree, and open 350 new Dollar Tree and 200 new family dollar stores. The company's CEO today said on CNBC, quote, we're confident that we're taking the appropriate steps to reposition our family dollar brand for increasing profitability as business initiatives gain traction in the back half of fiscal 2019. Shoppers, though, just hope their favorite store is spared the chopping block. I'd be disappointed because it's nice and clean. It's nice and clean and friendly people here. Now to put this whole thing into perspective, Family Dollar operated seven, or, or Dollar Tree, I should say, which owns Family Dollar, operated 7,001 Dollar Tree stores and 8,236 Family Dollar stores as of February 2nd. Certainly, the number of stores slated to close versus what they own and operate is a very small number, and it doesn't matter unless one of those stores slated to close is the one that's in your neighborhood that you depend on. Live in Tampa, Rod Carter, News Channel 8.